Hi besties! Welcome back to my channel. I hope you are all having a wonderful day today. I'm so happy to have you here with me. Thank you so much for watching and clicking on my video. Please like and subscribe if you like this kind of content. We are going to do a mainly Timu shoe haul and it's not going to be a long one so you know that's probably a good thing i have like one two three four maybe like a half a dozen pairs of shoes here i've been waiting to open so i thought i'd do them kind of all at once and then there's a couple other little accessory items but i thought to make it a, at least worth your while that maybe we would really kind of look at each pair of shoe and i could give you an idea of whether they're probably going to be worth it or not <laughs> based on my other shoes that i own um you know, I bought a couple of pairs of the Timu, like the Hey Dudes that are like, uh, you know, replica or dupe or whatever you want to call them. And I really like them, but I wouldn't say they're shoes that are going to last you the long haul per se. So anyways, we'll just kind of get right into this. Um, I will leave a links for everything down below in the description box. I will also put a pinned comment uh, down below with all the links. Uh, to my cart so that you can find these shoes if you're interested in them and I think I have some nails and a couple other things so but yeah I thought maybe to make it worth it I would kind of like we'll really look at each shoe I will put a picture up on the screen as well of each shoe so you can see what it looks like on um I was gonna like film my feet but I'm like how am I gonna do it's kind of weird and I didn't I thought it might look weird so uh Timu takes some pretty good pictures of their stuff, but so I thought maybe if I showed them like on somebody, that might be better for you as well. But anyway, let's just get right into this. Um, okay, let me find some glasses that I can wear because I cannot see a daggone thing. Okay, so here we go. Spectacles on. We're going to start with this pair right here. Now I wear, these look huge for me. I'm just looking at this and I, I always get the same size from Timu. I always get a... Um, 38 or 39 which I is supposed to be like around a seven or seven and a half but these look way bigger than that so I don't know <laughs> anyway I thought these were really cute they were 1403 um but again they kind of look a little big for a seven so I don't know but they look like this um they're just like kind of like chucks or converse but they look pretty well made um I love the, you know, the shoestrings and everything. They're they're very cute. Um, they've got like this floral pattern on them and mostly white. And then they've got like a raw hem around the edge. But I don't know, do they they look like kind of big for a seven? I don't know. I'm not sure. I'll I'll have to see. I mean I could probably wear them, but like usually in the summer I like to wear shoes without socks so you know but anyways the tongue also has the print on it but i just thought they were really cute and like i said i'll try and put a picture up of the model but these look really nice um the the insides are made really nice the sole of the shoes pretty well made i don't see any issues with any of the stitching or anything um this part up here i will say feels a little bit plasticky um you know it's obviously not real leather uh, but honestly, they're, they look like they're made pretty well. I think they're really cute, really cute summer shoe. Um, but yeah, I think they look a little bit too big for me. I'm not sure. I mean, that's why I hate ordering shoes off Timu because I never really know my size, you know? And honestly, sometimes depending on if it's a boot or a shoe, I go anywhere between a six and a half and a seven and a half or a six even. So, I don't know, but here's the first pair, 1403. I think they're cute for 14 bucks. I mean, honestly, adorable, stinking adorable. I love the print, super cute. So, yeah, there's the first pair. Okay, let's go with these next. These are, are super cute, too. I love these. These were all 1189, and I got these in a 39. So, I, I, I guess I kind of felt like 39 was my size. Um... These are kind of big too. Maybe they're just maybe they're just bigger than I don't know. Maybe I'm just nuts. But anyways, these are eleven eighty nine. They're pretty much exactly like the first pair. Only these are red, white, and blue. These are so cute, stinking adorable. You've got like this print along the side. The print looks really nice. Um, I like that they stuff their shoes too. But yeah, the insides made really nice. Um, this. This feels better than the last pair. 
Um, but I think they're cute. Super cute. And I'm going to a rally on Monday, so yeah. I think I might wear these. They will match the shirt that I got. So They're not really a rally, but anyway. We don't talk politics on this channel, but... <laughs> Anywho, I really like them. I think they're cute. They look really cute. Um, they're not real heavy. They're not real heavy, like as in weight. Which, honestly, this pair feels heavier. So... You know, but I think they're really cute. Adorable. So I'll try and put a picture up of these two. But again, these were like eleven eighty nine, close to twelve bucks. For twelve bucks for a pair of shoes. I mean, even if they lasted you for a summer, I mean I buy shoes from Walmart and the shoes or boots and they only last me like a summer anyway, so now these were a little bit kind of dressier and I thought well I could maybe wear these to work I got these for free I don't know how it could have been a spin the wheel type of thing it could have been Timu's circle who knows but I got these for free and I thought they were stinking adorable um and I think they look really well made and again I got these in a 39 this is the color beige but how bougie do these look <laughs> how bougie do they look they look like some type of a loafer that like you know i'm from the hamptons and these are my shoes peasant no i'm just kidding i'm just teasing but anyway yeah got them in a 39 these look smaller than the other two so these probably will fit but i thought they were really cute i love the little gold buckle detail on them and the bottoms have like this tread i mean they're really really well made they look super comfortable too so i'm not mad at these but yeah i love this little like gold buckle detail very kind of like a dupe of i like how the heel comes up back here too look at that i don't know do you think these are a dupe of something or if they are let me know because i'm not real good with my designers but the insides actually look really well made too the stitching is good except for maybe up here around the toe but again they've been in the box or, you know, in the bags. So they might have got smooshed a little bit, but I got these for free. They were free. What? So, yeah. We'll try them out. I think they're really cute. Yeah. Super cute for those. Okay. Next are these. Um, they were $13.99. Again, got them in the same... Well, wait. These say 38 So, maybe I don't... Maybe I think I'm between a 38 and a 39 I don't know. These, I'm not too sure about. <laughs> They aren't quite my style, but they're kind of cute. Um, I mean, I'm, I feel like these aren't going to be very comfortable. Um, I like the bottoms of them. And I like that they have like this stitching across here. But this material here is what worries me. This material. Like, is it going to be itchy? It looks like it might be itchy. I don't know. And some of the stitching's coming up right here, but I don't know. They're kind of cute. I mean, they might be cute on, you know? So, I don't know. I mean, we'll see what they look like on. But, I mean, they're, they're, they're not bad. They're not bad. And I don't know. There's like an AN down here, like some type of designer, but I don't know why. Not very cushiony right here, but they're not horrible. I mean, I've had worse. So, I don't know. What do you guys think of these? What do you guys think of these? Are they too much? Like, do they do they look tacky or any? I don't know. I mean, I like black and gold together, but I just don't know how they will look on and if they will have... They obviously have no structure at all, so... I don't know. What do you guys think? What do you guys think of these? They're okay. I mean... Hmm. Mm -hmm. $13.99 for those? I just don't know. I just don't know about those. Not my favorite, but not the worst pair of shoes I've ever bought in my life. Okay, these are kind of like the Hey Dude dupes. These were only $9.79. I got them in a, a 38 in the color khaki. I think these are adorable. Super adorable. Again, with the loafer. Apparently, I'm into loafers. But they kind of remind me of Hey Dudes. So this is what they look like. I think they're cute. I love the white stitching right along here. I love that. And they almost look like a burlap, you know what I mean? Like, I like the way they look. This is the bottom. Yeah, 
yeah, I mean, these aren't bad. Very lightweight. Very, very lightweight. And there is, like, some padding along here. And let me feel the inside. They actually stuffed these. I mean, they don't feel bad at all. I think these would be adorable with some, like, capris. How cute are they? I think these are adorable. For under 10 bucks, yes. Love. I think these are my favorite so far. Okay, break from the shoes for a hot minute. Let's do some of these accessories that I got. Um, here's a pair of nails. Me and my nails. <laughs> $3.53 for these. Um, these are the handmade nails. I always get them in a medium. I accidentally ordered a small one time and they're just too small for me. So I think I bought these before, but they are so pretty. I like these a lot. If I can get them out of the bag for you. Okay, these are really pretty. They're like a gold and a beigey pink kind of color, but $3.53 for these, that's pretty good because sometimes, I, I just think that's a really good price for these. Like, I noticed they've been going up on Timu website where some of the handmade nails are like eight or nine bucks. I'm like, yeah, no, I, I am not paying eight or nine dollars for nails. Absolutely not. So you get the nails, whoop, I almost dropped it, it jumped right out of there. An alcohol pad, the glue tabs, and the uh, orange stick and a file. So yeah, $3.53 for those. Really cute. Love those. And then I got this set, which I will wear with those red, white, and blue shoes. These were $1.20, and they are red, white, and blue nails. <laughs> How cute are those? They've got like the red, white, and blue flag, and there's some sparkle to them. I don't know. I think they're cute. They'd be cute for like 4th of July or Memorial Day or Labor Day or something like that. So we'll see. Maybe I'll wear those. $1.20. Not bad for a set of nails. Oh, wait. Let me see. And again, you get the glue tabs, which I've been using the glue tabs so I can change my nails more often. And you get a file. But yeah, the glue tabs, they don't last long. I mean, you know, if you, if I put my glue tabs on with these because... Um, they're a lot longer than I usually wear, so I don't really want them to stay on forever. There is no way I could type with these. Absolutely no way. So, yeah. I'll probably take them off by tomorrow. <laughs> Maybe. But yeah, these were only $1.20, so I thought they were really cute. And then I got a couple of eyelash sets. Now, these look super duper long. They were $2.50. They are eyelash segments. I mean, they look really way too long. So $2.50 for these. Um, it says Fair Finny Dreamy Lash Clusters. And they go from like 18 millimeter. There's 18, 16, 16, 16. So they're, oh wait, are they all 16? Yeah, sorry. I, I obviously can't even read with glasses. They're all 16 millimeter lash segments. So I don't know how these will look. They're very long. I'm probably going to have to mix, you know, mix some of my shorter length with these. These are the ones I would usually put like on the outside, you know, as you go in, like with lash clusters, the ones I get from Amazon, I don't have to do that. Sorry guys, I'm like sweating over here. But I put like the 16s out here and then like 14s and 12s and 10s. If you do that, you get like a cat eye effect or the hybrids that I buy from Amazon, they kind of go up, down, up, down, up, down. I don't have to worry about those. But yeah, these are like 16 millimeters and that is pretty daggone big. So I don't know. I might have, they look really long. So I might have to like mix some lashes with those. But oops, I'm just pulled my hair out um anyway so it doesn't say how many are in here one two three four five six seven eight times five forty so there's forty clusters that's pretty good for two dollars and fifty cents so i think if they had this if this seller had this lash in like a 14 and a 12 i would go back and get the 14s and 12s and use 14 12 and 16s or i mean 12 14s and 16s because they look really good they look really pretty and the lash strip is not very big which is awesome so yeah i might go back and see if they have smaller ones that i can like mix with those okay then i got these and i'm looking at these going omg right so these were expensive they were nine dollars and twenty cents now these are the um magnetic ones and i will tell you why immediately i don't like these i will tell you why i will show you why um, so anyway, when you get the set, you get the little thing that holds the lash so you can 
put it on like so. Um, and it even tells you here's upper up or down. So I like that. And you get the instructions, which is good, on how to wear them. Now here you get two sets of lashes. Uh, okay. I, first off, just looking at these, look how wide the band is. I don't like that at all because it's so wide it's probably gonna hurt my eyeballs like look how wide this band is you know what I'm saying like it's so super wide right along the band and not only that but you let I don't know let me I mean okay it don't okay wait now it don't look as bad now that I took okay see they okay it's not as bad as I thought because look I pulled it off there and there's like, this is a magnet to hold it there. Okay, these might not be too bad. Might not be too bad. You know what? I have a lash on, but let's... I, we're going to try this. And I've never done this, but let's try it. Let's try it. I'll bring you in a little bit. All right. Um, okay, so... Okay. Okay, okay, okay. So you put... Okay, I need to put my glasses on to see what I'm doing. It sucks being blind. Okay. There's actually four sets of eyelashes in this box. Okay. This is, this is a set. This is a set. This is a set. And this is a set. Cause when you pull this off of here, it splits into two pieces. Good to know. Okay. So I have them so that the lashes are facing inward. If that makes sense. Cause when you put it on. Okay. Oh my gosh. This is good. Okay. Hold on. We're going to do this. We're going to do it, I think. All right. All right. All right. Oh, it's on, sort of. Okay. Okay, it's on. It's on. I, I think a little bit of practice would help. But it's on. Yay. I don't know how, like, it looks a little bit weird because I think I need to move it inward, like, if I were to wear it, but it's on. Okay, those are actually easier to work than I thought. I lied at first because I thought the band was really wide and it's not. So, honestly, I love these because if I don't have to glue my lashes on, I would probably wear more eye makeup. Now, I assume to take these off, you kind of just pull them and I'm probably going to pull, oh, they're strong. They're strong and I just pulled off. An eyelash. Okay, we'll put that over there. So you just kind of pull it off. Um, and then this box, th since there's a magnet here, you just put them back in the box. See, I thought that that thick line was the actual... Oh, I, it's not. It's not the actual lash. The lashes actually have very thin bands. Okay, these are worth nine bucks. I feel like they're worth nine bucks. Okay, I'm going to back you guys up. Okay, I really like those. I, I've changed my mind about them. I may use these next week to see if they will stay on. And, and so that's what the... So you get like the right eye, left eye, right eye, left eye, if you know what I'm saying. But the bands aren't as thick as I thought they were going to be. So I really like those. Well worth $9.20 because you can reuse them and you only have to buy them once. And you can take them off at night. I love that because I don't wear eye makeup specifically because... I wear eyelash segments, and when I put the eyelash segments on, I actually wear them for like a week. I don't actually like wash my eyeballs real good because like if I were to wear eye makeup because I'm always afraid my lashes will fall off. So to have a lash like that would be super helpful for me. Okay, back to the shoes. Back to the shoes. So I got these as well. Also red, white, and blue. These were $9.36. Now I got these in a 37. So I don't know what I'm doing with my life. I bought like a 37, a 38, and a 39. What am I doing? Okay, so these are like the hey dude kind of dupes. They are, they need, they're a little bit smushed. But they have like the red dots and then the red, white, and blue up here with white laces. And then the bottom. These are very, very light. Not super well made, but they're nine bucks. I mean, nine dollars, okay? So, this is what they look like. I think they're adorable. Like, you know, $9, you pay that for a pair of slippers, or probably more than that. So, I think they're cute. I might wear these to that thing I'm going to instead of those other ones. I don't know. We'll see. Okay, you got, we'll save these for last. Okay, the last two are very kind of bougie, but 
you know, it is what it is. Let's see. Okay, let's save the most expensive pair that I have out of these two. So these ones were $15.59, and they actually came in a box, okay? You guys are going to die when you see these. $15.59. I love these, and I don't know why, but I do. So look at these. Look at these. I got these in a 37 in the color brown, but OMG, they're like a patent leather type of look. How cute are these? I love these. I hope they fit. The inside is very cushiony, very well made. Now, they do look small. I mean, look at that. You better hope you have a thin foot. If you have wide feet, that, mm -mm. and I, my feet are not really super wide, but I mean, I think these are adorable. Now, I have no idea what I'm going to wear these with, but how cute are they? How cute. I love these. Love them. I love them. I don't know how many times I can say that. So cute. How cute. <laughs> and these are like really in like this patent leather type of look. So I'm impressed with those for 15 bucks. 15 bucks for those. I really like those. That's my favorite pair so far. Unless these really work out for me. So these were $18.69. Got them in a 38. So hopefully they fit. I really like these. A girl I work with actually bought a pair of these off of Timu. And I was like, oh my gosh, where'd you get your shoes? And she's like, I got them on Timu. And I was like, no way. I'm going to go get a pair. What? Look at that blinged out shoe. Heck yeah. Heck yeah. These are cool. I love these. I absolutely love these. How cute are they? How stinging cute. The, the, I mean, the bling that's coming off of these is crazy. How cool. And they've got like this silver part, like around the outside, round the outside, round the outside. How cute are these? OMG. I'm in love with these. I hope they fit. I hope they fit. I hope they fit. But how cool. They got like this stitching around here. They've even got bling along the bottom down here. Dang. And then this is the bottom. These are great. I love these. I think they're adorable. And they had these in different colors. Like, I think I almost got the black one, but I was like, mm, I don't know. You know what? I'm going to slide my foot into this, and then we're going to see. Okay, these fit. Okay, so I have socks on, and I just put these on, and they fit. And so they're a 38. So, I mean, they're just fitting, so they're super cute, though. I really like these. Plus, I'm sitting down, so I'm not standing up. But they've got a little bit of elastic right here. I love these. They're really cute. I'm glad I got those. Okay, I think that's it. That is it. Oh, whew, that was a lot of shoes. I hope I have somewhere to put all my new shoes. <laughs> all right, everybody. Thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Please like and subscribe. It's free to subscribe to my channel. There should be a little red box in one of these corners. I think it would be this one. I'm not sure. But it just says subscribe on it. Just click that. It's free to subscribe. So then you know when I upload my next haul. Thank you so much for watching. I will put all the links down below. I hope you have a super wonderful day. And I will see you in the next one. Bye.